if I get 10,000 likes, I'll do Larry in the hole naked. Salutations, it's your preferred pack pulling Papa Larry here, and we are back at Target finally. I was allowed a brief reprieve this week. I get $40 to spend on, I guess, whatever product that we've missed throughout the past few times, because nothing really new has come out since ever, because you know why. But whatever I am in the hole from last time will remain until our next episode. So here we are at Target in the seasonal candy section. I'd hurt myself here. Even now today, like I feel like when we were younger, or as Paul likes to say yesterday, um, we actually went trick or treating like, parents kicked you out of the house, all right, go, don't come back till it's nighttime. And then you walk the neighborhood and you came back with your candy and you know, do whatever, have fun. That was a fun night. And it always sucked when it was a school night, like a Monday. Oh, I hate it when Halloween was like Monday. It's, it's just weird. Fun, see, this is, I'd buy all of this. Fun dip. Oh, I remember this as a kid. Yeah, yeah with the little cocaine sticks. And it seems like all the time, whenever we go in stores, I end up like finding something and it reminds me of a story from my youth a long, long time ago. This reminds me of, I was in elementary and they had passed, I think they were doing some fundraiser. I don't know what it's for, but they passed out this box. It was called the big box. It was this giant blue cardboard box and it was filled with different candy bars. And they were passing it out, I guess for us to sell like a dollar each. I did not hear at that point because I was just focused on the fact that my teacher had given me a giant big ass box of candy. I ate most of it before I even got on the bus that day. And I guess to sell it was optional, but you still had to bring back the, the, money, that the, the money or the box with all the candies in it. And I had eaten all of it. Like, I love Three Musketeers, I love Crunch Bars. I realized that I loved 100 grams. I just ate all of it. And then my mom was mad at me because I had eaten all the stuff that I was supposed to sell. Ooh, I actually saw something here last time, and there it is. I'm like, this is for you, Alec. Look, a Gundam Death Sigh. Wait, that's actually a real? Yeah. Huh. I know they like just sold Gundams like. Mm -hmm. Is that a Hello Kitty All Might? Yeah, there's actually a, um, I don't know if you knew. That's there's funny. A, there's a Hello Kitty X My Hero Academia is like a, a thing apparently. I saw a jacket ad on Facebook for it. I didn't know Hello Kitty was still a thing. And then, then there's giant Pokemon Pops. No, I need Which that. I didn't, like where did that even come from? I mean, they'll make a pop out of anything and people will buy it. They really, really will. I'm hungry. You could buy the Halloween candy, that's dinner. No, I'd, I'd get it plus that. And also sick, but because because and then because my favorite candy of all time, I don't know if anybody can guess it, um, are fruities. Fruities? What is a fruity? Fruity. They're these tiny little candies that you undo. They're like little, I guess, not really quite gummy, little bits of deliciousness, and they come in all different flavors. And you chew them, and then you swallow them. And and my wife, who's a school teacher buys them sometimes for her kids and i tell her whenever she buys her kids a, a bag she has to buy me some because i'm just going to eat the ones that she bought for her kids and she can fuss at me but she ain't gonna get her candy back or, or when kids. she does it's not going to be in any form she wants but think of the children they'll be all right <laughs> i tell myself i'm sponsored by razor just razor doesn't know it yet because I, I i told paul i thought about um, starting an esports club slash league at this high school that's near the jurisdiction that I work at, but maybe later. You should, wait, what? I'm gonna so, show you these. Huh? What is this? Just a, it's a pen. Pens? Yeah. I kind of want them. I mean, they're ten. Else? They're ten dollars for pens. Fire Force ones. Have you seen Fire Force? I've watched a few episodes, but all the episodes I watch, every time I put it on, like, ooh, this is on. It's always the same episode. This Animal Crossing journal with notebook and 2122 calendar. I'm getting this from my wife. That actually would be, she'll, she'll be happy. Wait, they have a whole, there's purses and backpacks and everything. I don't know if she wants, ooh. Socks, Jesus Christ, I didn't know they had everything. I'm gonna get her Animal Crossing socks. I guess now she won't be upset with you about spending money on Yu-Gi-Oh no, Yu -Oh no, cards. Oh no, she'll be upset with me spending money on Yu-Gi-Oh cards, but I'll be able to sneak away while she's looking at the stuff. I would get her this. This is a Switch carrying thing. Oh, I thought it was a purse. I guess it makes sense though, huh? I would get her this. This. I turned into... This. I turned into Joey. 
I would get her this, but I don't know if she's gonna use it. I'll just ask her about it when I get home. Of course, you got your Pokemon. They got, they got a buttload of tins. I, I see, I see nothing between this section. This is all just bare space. But here, this is Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. Did you buy any of this? These? Yeah. I bought two. What do you think of this? Eh, it, it left a little bit to be desired. Now, don't get me wrong, there are some good reprints in them and like some good like shiny bit upgrades with like the red eye stuff if you're into that sort of thing. Because some, some of this stuff like red eyes baby dragon was expensive for, for no reason. I'll tell this, you what. This uh, red eyes gear freed was expensive for no reason. You know what I'm actually looking forward to is the sequel, Legendary Duel Season 2. It's got the is Kaiba that with the and Kaiba the and the Mai stuff? It's got okay. like Blue Eyes Bingo Machine. Because uh, that card is expensive. For, for, for a good reason, but still. Photon Orbital is going to be in there. The train thing that's like kind of expensive is all going to be. Who's running trains? Like Alec and Jarrell, I don't know. Oh, wow. <laughs> <That's> something. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Here's some old sets that you probably know oh, and love. Nope. Just. <laughs> Um, didn't like Flames of Destruction as a set when it came out, because I never pulled anything good. Impermanence is in there, which is pretty cool. A one card. Fusion Enforcers. Why an, is an, that oldie here? But, an oldie but goodie. Hmm, somebody probably found them. That's Flames of Destruction. Um, somebody probably found them in a warehouse somewhere. Very really, really old Duelist Alliance. See, because it's not even in this original. Like oh, the, yeah, this like is like the, the vendor, oh. like some vendor that probably provides this stuff here. And usually they'll send them out to the ones that they that usually buy them out the most. So if you go to your local Target or Walmart, I know this because I worked in retail for a little bit. You know, if you go to like your Walmart, your Targets, don't go to Walmart, your Targets, your Books of Millions. And if you buy their stuff, there's a, there's a higher chance that they will eventually get more because they know that people buy them. There's a fun one. Everyone loves their legendary duelist, Rage of Ra. Ooh, slimes or dimes. Elusive ghost rare thing that's... Imagine if we a pulled lot. that though. You always say that. And 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 Paul, I have I have to be honest. What? I hate when you say that. Oh, because I'm jinxing it? Yes. I'm sorry. The like All right, next time I won't say anything. You, you go into it expect just expecting to get whatever you get, and then you're pleasantly surprised when you get good. If you go, oh, what if we pull it? Mmm. Sorry for you're not gonna up, get it. Larry. Don't Jeez, get Jeez, Larry. I'm sorry for getting my hopes up. You can get your hopes up, just keep them to yourself. Is, is this little. the one that the everyone wants because it's the only thing that has the power? I mean, maybe. I no, this is Transcode Talker. Yeah, I know. Target always has these. It's this, these this, old. this everyone bought because it had the link to Rebo. Yeah, I think the reprint of it. Or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever I get doesn't count toward my total in the whole value, but whatever I do good, like bumps it up. So I can go up, but I can't go back down, yeah, or I can't bonus. get dig myself deeper. I'm gonna get a 10, and I don't care what you say. Oh jeez, you like these 10s, huh? I like 10s in general, because they do have good reprints, ex ex except if you don't pull them. Yeah, I guess that's true. Um, I did it right there. There's no way you can feel it out from that, right? I don't got this thing at all. If you wonder. Jesus Christ. There it is, I'll tell you. I'm gonna get the one all the way in the back. Three Rage of Raw. Okay. Um, two Fusion Enforcers. It's a cute throwback. Um, and it actually has one of my favorite artworks of all time with Invocation Secret Rare. I like that. I just I just like that artwork. Um, just this one Mega Ten. Okay, and then six, technically six. Six um, Rage of Raws. Nice. Okay, that seems fair. We can't even sit down at uh, Starbucks. Oh yeah. I guess they, they took the tables away. All right. So here we are. Again, everything that I pull can only bring me up. I can't go any further down than what I already am. I'm sure Paul will put how much I'm in the hole right here. Let's start with Fusion Enforcers. Got to make sure. Oh, I forgot the secrets at the front. Ah. Fluffles and Alistair. Nothing. I have to make sure to put this up because I don't want to litter. I feel like they shouldn't put the secret in the front, you know what I mean? Mm, they, I don't, like they, like they, don't, they don't care. They're like, here. Get your, like it, it ruins the surprise, you know? Get your stupid thing. Fluffle sheet. 
um, whatever that is. Might as well be toilet paper. Straight garbage. And the last thing. Oh man, this is a spell. I was about to be like, that. Uh. Rage of Raw next. Because I know I'll at least pull shiny stuff in the Mega 10. Jinzo Ejector. Holding arms. Disciple that a wild monster appears. Oh, I always forget these don't guarantee you a hollow. Uh, that's what I said. You're not promised nothing. Yeah, these are mean. <laughs> Amplifier. Reboot. Brain control. Necklord. Why don't they put Necklords in here? They don't. I'm just gonna skip and go straight to the back. A wild monster appears. Oh, a psychic. Oh, a psychic bounder? Yeah. I, don't I think I actually needed that. I ordered one of those and then it got lost in the mail. Disciple. That. Jones of Lord. Everlasting Alloy. Boon of the Mechlord. What do Mechlords even do? They destroy themselves and it kind of helps. Cosmic Challenging. Channeling, I'm sorry. That is no card. Mm. That's an Esperoba card. Yo, left arm offering. You know when this card was expensive? I do actually. Grass, like bad grass or whatever. Uh huh, you do what you want, another one. Wait, another one? Whoa, I'll take that. You, you, you did what you wanted, and then you had left arm offering, and then you pay it, and then do whatever. But, we got this big boy. Like I said, it's pretty much Dragoon or Bust. I don't say Dragoon or Bust. Dragoon and hopefully, and maybe other stuff if whatever deity you worship likes you. I'm so tired of sunlight wolves. Do you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's funny. I didn't feel. Time Thief Winder. Danger with Beast. Ooh. Secret Boil Old Savage. I did need that. Witchcrafter Pottier. Pottery. Pottery. Get out. Final Light. Witchcraft Draping. Glassy Flay. Yeah, Glassy Flay. If I can get, if I can find some rare versions of her, I really want that. I'm also looking for the super rare versions of the uh, the new Messengelado and the OTS pack. Pretty excited about that. Battle Ocean. I'm so tired. Dino Wrestlers. Nice card. I'm just gonna run this in like Dark Magician and make like a dra small Dragon Link engine. Is that a thing? You could, cause it, cause this one in the blue water guy says if you control the spellcasters, you can special summon it for free. So. Chaos Betrayer, Fury of Fire. You have to forgive me. My like five things are horrible. Pro Legacy Guard Dragon. I didn't mind another secret one of these. One of the better ones to get. Ultra. Oh man, I'm Storm Dragon's Return. Nix Ultra. Infinitrack Mountain Smasher. Marincess Wave. That's the final pack, huh? Yep. Rising Fire. Mar Dark. Or like see cliffhang Cl oh it is cliffhanger. Okay. I thought it said gilfhanger. I was like, oh my. Gilfhanger? Gilfhanger, yeah. And Arita. Next super. Rogue of Endymion, the one useless Endymion card that no one likes or runs. Our secret is Ooh. IP Mascarina. Hey. All good secrets in these. Yeah, pretty good secrets. Ultra. Whoa. Okay. Midnight Evermax. I don't like it as an Ultra. It's much more sexier as a secret. I like Opelosa as an Ultra. But that new. Have you, wait, have you seen the new gold Opelosa? Have you seen it? Just right in my face. Yeah. Um. Yeah, when she's missing her bear. Yeah. Where is the bear? That's you. Final Ultra. Oh. Spin turn. And it, looked, it looked like a fusion. It mm. really did. Cap shell. Teeny stuff. Not a horrible ten, but not too bad. After some world class arithmetic by our what do you have a master then? Business stuff. Borlote Savage is about ten. IP is eight. Four Legacy Guard Dragon is four. And Avermax is two. Plus a dollar for those other two things. Psychic Bounder. It's yeah. a good card. A dollar for both the psychic bounders. So that gives me 25 altogether. Whatever I was at last time, plus 25, 
and this is my finger. Like, you make it happen on this finger. Uh -huh. This is the magic finger. Plus the 25 gives me a brand new total going in for next time. See what happens when you don't go to Walmart? As always, if you like what we do here, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Comment down below. I've been Larry. This has been Better Larry in the Hole. See y'all next time.